بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ویل گائز آئی ایم گوئنگ ٹو شیئر سم آف دا ریزلٹس آف مائی اسٹوڈینٹس اینڈ آئی ایم گوئنگ ٹو ٹیل یو ہاؤ ٹو ایویلویٹ ویدر یو نیڈ ٹو گو فار ای یو آر اور ناٹ اینڈ یو کین سی ہاؤ شاکنگ سم ریزلٹس آر ہاؤ ان ایکسپیکٹیڈ دے آر فار سم کینڈیڈیٹس Let's go on with this first result. It's actually from India. I'll not show you the details. In India, a student got 8 band in listening, 6 band in reading, 7.5 band in speaking, but 5.5 in writing. Now see the difference of two bands in speaking and in writing. Whenever there is anything, a candidate who is answering the questions well in speaking, how come that candidate is capable of getting 5.5 in writing? Sometimes there can be the reasons like spelling mistakes and all that. But anyways, 7.5 in speaking and 5.5 in writing. This distance of two band creates doubts on the examiner and examiner's performance to gauge the level proficiency level of the candidate so that's why i have advised this student to go for eor and good luck with him when the result comes out i'll share that with you after that i've got another result where a student got 8.5 in listening 9 band in reading look at that listening 8.5 reading 9 band speaking 7 and writing 6 see fair keen de buta gala kadde buta gala kyu na kadde a guy who's got 8.5 listening means he understands english well reading 9 band his comprehension is very well 9 out of 9 and in speaking you are giving 7 and 6 in writing so this raises some doubts Okay how come how come one guy is proficient in reading up to 9 proficient in listening up to 8.5 but in writing you are giving him 6 and uh, in speaking you are giving him 7 so i have recommended eor to this candidate also and he has applied when his result comes out i'll tell you about that and he is also from india let's go on then i've got this story it will surprise you I mean a guy from Pakistan he appeared in his IELTS test overall band score is 5.5 listening 5.5 reading 5.5 writing 6 band but speaking 4 band now if someone is capable of getting 6 in writing which is more difficult than speaking and he is getting only 4 band in speaking that means there is something wrong at the bottom or that means he entirely misunderstood the cue card and he did not perform well in the cue card that's why they gave him speaking band so you need to evaluate yourselves whenever you are getting low band score is it my fault like we say in punjabi apni peedi thalle bhi dang pher liya karo means you should identify your own mistakes also and then you get to know about that okay guys i've got a long list like this so i mean the purpose of making this video is to aware you when to apply for eor how to decide whether you deserve or you should go for eor or not let me tell you eor will never improve your band score in listening and reading EOR will never improve your band score in writing and speaking just because you need half band extra. EOR will only improve your band score if you were marked wrongly and you were underrated in actual IELTS test and you were given low band score then your capability only in that case EOR will improve your band score. That's all guys thank you very much I also teach IELTS online if you want to join my online IELTS classes my whatsapp number is given you can contact me for that Asad Yakub truly wishes you best of luck if you are planning to apply EOR do inform me about your EOR result and I'll make a video that video will guide others to go for EOR as well because many students when they share their eor success story they just quote one thing sir i watched your video on eor so who knows 
it's going to be your story that i would share with others all the best guys thank you very much take care allah hafiz